Welcome back to another vlog guys. Today I want to focus on cleaning up my space and just getting my life together because it's been a mess and I'm sorry I haven't uploaded in a while. It's because, well, I feel like I haven't been feeling the best. I woke up a little bit earlier today so I can get, you know, my, my, my place in check. And for the summer, I want my place to feel like calm. My bedroom's not too bad, but I do have a lot of laundry I need to put in and maybe vacuum up a lot of things. I sold my table. I've been working on my coffee table and it's just a mess. It's just like a low coffee table and a bunch of piled up stuff around it. So I do want to clear that stuff up. I got an offer to showcase a beauty tutorial on Fenty, so I have to edit that. So today's gonna be a pretty Pretty busy day. It was tax day also a couple days ago, that's why everything was in shambles and I was just stressing out about everything, which is not good. I do this guided meditation every morning for releasing anxiety and I feel like it's helped. I'll put it on the link down below so you can do it to start off your day. But essentially, that's what I'm trying to do. Just be a little bit productive around the house and uh, yeah. Oh, I also got these tank tops from Target. It's from this brand called A New Day and they're women's tank tops but they are so soft and breathable. It allows me to move really well too. It's just really really nice. Like these are just great tank tops. I got them in a size XL. The brand's called A New Day ribbed tank top or something but they're so soft. Like they're softer than men's tank top so I like it a lot better. Remember when tank tops used to be called the wife beaters? God, it was a horrible time. But there are a lot of different colors. So I got black, khaki, and also rose colored. So that's nice. I've been experimenting with more clothing on TikTok and also Instagram, so it's been really fun. Who knew crop tops were that cute and fun? <laughs> My mouse, this one is ergonomic and it's like a Bluetooth mouse, but it just stopped working. I tried cleaning this sensor right here, but I'm so sad it stopped working. I changed the batteries also, but I think it's time to let it go. It's a very good shape for my wrist also, but uh, back to using the razor. You like that sometimes. Laundry is still in the wash, but the place looks pretty clean. I'm pretty happy with how it looks. I moved my computer into the room so that it would look cleaner. But yeah, I'm liking how it looks right now. For lunch, I think I'm gonna make a sandwich to prep for a workout later probably. So I'm gonna have to eat a lot. I'm trying to rest a little bit more versus working out. Cause I used to work out almost every day. Now I'm trying to work out only like maybe four or five times a week, which is still a lot for some people, but for me, it's like not that much. So yeah, I'm gonna make maybe avocado and vegan deli sandwich. Gorgeous sandwich. So excited to eat this. Got my cup of soy milk. And also my sandwich. Mmm, I'm so excited. Ah, wow, so good. I'm so hungry. A little snack this morning. Not enough. Mmm, mmm. Hello, what do you want? That's my food. I like adding like pumpkin seeds and granola for a little bit of texture. Just adding little, little bits of crunchy pieces makes everything like ties everything together. Mmm. -hmm. I think I'm gonna do a chest workout later. So my, my arm is feeling better from the vaccination. Hmm. Want water? Come here. Give me water right here. Give me ice in it. She likes ice in the water. I don't know why she likes ice. Look, she's so weird. Weird, you look weird though. Maybe the water feels more refreshing that way.
just woke up from the fattest nap. <laughs> so, yeah, time to work out. I think I'm gonna go hiking sometime this week, so I really am excited for that. I uh, have a panel on Thursday also about Asian American uh, and Pacific Islander content creation and stopping Asian hate. It's about Instagram and Facebook creation. I don't really use Facebook that much, but I, I mean, I use Instagram all the time. So that will be interesting. I want to see what other, you know, influencers and people have to say about, I guess, the whole situation and that what steps we can do to make social media in general a safer space for everyone to be in. So I think that's really important, which is nice. I'm sorry if these vlogs are like just me at home because like my life recently, especially after getting a vaccine, I had to just rest for three days. And today I still feel kind of like fatigued, but I really wanted to get up and vlog and clean and just feel so much better because yeah, I'm still very careful. I don't really go out that much because I'm still trying to do my part in terms of keeping everything in control. But I checked the COVID cases recently and in LA it's actually gone down a lot. So that's very, very good to hear. Even though I'm fully vaccinated now, I'm still gonna take precaution, but I think it will make me feel more comfortable with going out and doing more stuff outside. So thank you for bearing with me. I got Bearology the other day, like it's a boba place. They send the boba in a glass cup and I was like, I'm gonna reuse this because it's so cute. Look, it's a bear. Bearology. The study of bears. Just, I don't know. I think boba bear. Oh, it's boba bear, not bearology. Yeah, this is bearology still. It's so very cute. My favorite, favorite pre-workout of all time is this one by LTS. Please don't buy all of it because they sell out quickly. Actually, I'm not gonna even share. I'm just kidding. They do sell out, so sometimes I have to like buy two just to stock up. I have another one up there, but this one is the best pre-workout. It doesn't make my stomach hurt, doesn't make me bloat for some reason. It's weird, but yeah, it works really well. Also, it gives me a really good I'm Gonna add a little bit of creatine. I add some creatine when I really want to lift hard, I guess would be the word, because it does make me feel stronger. I just use half the dosage of what the recommended is anyways which is like five grams. Mix in some fresh pressed orange juice for the workout. If you have trouble starting workout, I recommend putting on like a really good EDM track. I'm listening to Ray at the moment. Oh my god, Espa came up with uh, Next Level. I'm gonna be playing that when I'm working out too. If you haven't seen the video, the video is crazy. I also never heard this song before and apparently it's a sample of um, Fast and Furious. Too Fast, Too Furious. The Fast and the Furious, I don't know. I, I'm, do I look like the type that watch The Fast and the Furious? So good. So I'm gonna play that while workout, and today we are going to do chest. Done with my workout. I'm so so tired. I'm gonna make some protein and rest for a little bit. It's a it's been a pretty long day. I just got some comments in my I mean got some DMs after I posted the Espa clip of Next Level. Y'all seem to not really like them. Um, I think the song is pretty catchy, albeit I feel like it was like three songs in one. Uh, but I still think it was catchy. I worked out to it. This move. That's so cute. I really liked it. Honestly, guys, sometimes I know cleaning up the space and everything is can be quite tiring. But it's really worth it. Like, when I have my place all clean and nice, 
and the wires all tucked away, the trash taken out, laundry clean. It just feels good. And, you know, because I've been home so much, having such a clean space just, it's just great for my mind, you know, sometimes. I think it's also one of those things where there's not a lot of things in the world I can control, but my space is something that I can control. So I try not to overthink it, but yeah, it's, I think it's a way of me having a little bit of a sense of safety. I think it's good. I think it's good to have a clean space. I don't know. And the funny thing with these plants is that like, at first when I only got like one or two, it looked really messy. But the more I have them, like the more they just blend into the space more. Like the more plants I have. I have so many plants now. It's great. Look at all the plants. Love it. So I want to do a makeup look, but sometimes before doing it on my face, instead of putting it on and then seeing if it works, I will look for a template and then go and procreate and kind of like sketch out the piece first. The tricky part is always finding like a face that kind of looks like mine. I mean, obviously I could use my own face, but I found this one right here. John June. So this is kind of like what I want to create, what I have right now. We'll see if I can actually do that. I feel like it could work. Let's see how that comes out. Oh, I didn't record this, but I felt really creative today and I just wanted to play with a little makeup. So this is the look I came up with. Um, I initially wanted to draw a little bit more with um, the white liner, but I think I got a little bit carried away. It's really hard to do white liner to be honest, but I kind of like it. It took me like about an hour to do. Now I'm gonna take it off and eat some dinner. Because of this, I ordered takeout and I just, I couldn't cook. But yeah, maybe I'll start doing tutorials again. I just haven't felt like wanting to be on camera like this close. You guys know my own issues, but yeah, it's been fun. I really like the look. Sometimes you just gotta do it. I love playing with makeup. It's like such a fun way to like paint and practice painting and stuff. I've been doing more graphic looks recently. I think it's more fun. I still wear normal makeup, like daily makeup for daily, but these looks are like cute. Also, I posted on my stories, I'm trying to find a good anime to watch, a non-gory or non-bloody one that also has fantasy. I find that fantasy usually comes with action, which comes with gore, so it's hard to find one. So if you know of one that is kind of like mild, but also fantasy, like maybe some magic, that would be great, let me know. I'm actually gonna hop in the shower. I'm gonna try my skincare later. Noodles, curry, and some rice, and then I usually get more because since I live alone, I usually eat it tomorrow also, so that saves me. More meals with less delivery, you know what I'm saying? Ooh, excited to eat. I'm gonna watch a show and eat. I'm not sure what I'm gonna watch, but yeah, I'm so hungry. Thai food is honestly the best. Mm.